Hey everybody, Mike Stanley here, reporting to you from the training room in Point Pleasant Beach. The Milkman is in Avon. Today's Wednesday. We've got a nice strength slash conditioning workout for you. We're going to do four different things. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to go 20 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. We're going to use a fixed rest period today, fixed work period, fixed rest period. We're going to take 20 seconds. We're going to take our time on performing the movement. So what we're going to do is we're going to start out with a kettlebell split squat. All right. So a couple of different ways of doing the split squat. You can either clean the bell up, all right, split the feet, you can perform 20 seconds on one side, keeping your posture, driving that front heel, rest for 20 seconds, clean the bell up with the other side, okay, rest for 20 seconds, six rounds, you can also rack the bell up with two hands, and perform the same split squat, or you can even add a little suspension component by using the jungle gym, XT, slip one toe in, okay, you can even grab the bell at the bottom here, perform your 20 seconds, or you can even rack it at the shoulder or hold it in the middle, all right, so you have a whole bunch of options there in your split squat. So, after we finish our six rounds of that, we're going to take a two minute rest. The next movement is going to be a clean and press. So, 20 seconds, clean and press. All right, nice strict. Take your time, okay? Find your pace. See what your number is going to be. Stick with that number. Don't go to muscle failure. Do your 20 seconds, clean and press, rest, other side. Six rounds. Okay, take our two minute rest. Then uh, we'll give you the choice between a one arm row with the bell. You might have to move up on, on your weight a little bit here. Nice control movement. You can also do a one arm body weight row if you want. Alright, so set the jungle gym up or ring about hip height. Adjust your body, find the right spot. Nice strict one arm row, keeping the shoulder in the socket. Don't let the shoulder get pulled out of the socket. You keep the shoulder square. You can make it a little bit easier by moving back or more difficult by moving forward. So there's your one arm row, switching each side, 20 on, 20 off. Then we're going to finish up with a little abdominal complex uh, choice of walkouts. So we'll go 20 seconds of walkout or plank. Okay. Then we can go. Do a side plank, all right, mix the ride, 20 seconds, take that rest in between each one, okay, other side, all right, what we'll do is we'll do uh, four rounds, uh, so you'll do each movement four times on that one, all right, so that's it for today, there's your strength slash conditioning, endurance, strength endurance workout for today, enjoy, let us know how you do, okay, the whole idea here is to stick with your rep scheme next time you do this workout. If you find that it's too easy, if you're doing, say you're doing six reps on a clean and press, and the next time you, you know, it goes up a little bit higher, it goes to seven, then you may want to just bump your weight up a little bit on um, the next time you do this workout. So that's it for today. Have a great week. Peace.